you know, this is exactly what I assume of Kaguya. Are we ever going to get a moment that isn't close calls and almost slip-ups? Is there going to be a time when anyone actually wins? If there is, it's not for a long way off. And right now we get to enjoy the absolute insanity that this group can bring in their little games, in their little battles, in their little wars. But all the time, we're rooting for Ishigami, really. And of course, after they've made up so well, even though he didn't know anything was particularly wrong. I feel Ishigami uh, <laughs> holds some animosity to their happiness. <laughs> yeah, he's just out here trying his best to just uh, play his little, uh, little console. Should be forced into witnessing other people being happy. Well, we're four episodes in now. If we're going for the usual length, same length as the, the pre previous season, are we going to see a lot more of these other side characters? I think I've mentioned it every time I see the opening, but... And are we going to see other... big set pieces like we did at the end of the other one? Maybe the going out on another fireworks festival, another sports event or anything. Shine shine beam. Well, if one of them dies, it does involve. We definitely split them up that way. Well, uh, Ishigami, aren't you also relatively low... Oh, oh, okay. Distracted by video games, but also not doing great in his studies. I see. The only one to... Bring him out in a fluster. A good idea. I don't really remember the end of the other season, but were they this <laughs> this close to the end of the other season? And him regaining. Composure so quickly. Yeah, just a matter of fact, mark of shock. Overly animated fingers reminds me of Konosuba, just not so creepy. <laughs> yeah. Try not to make it show on your face as you go. <laughs> I mean, there's definitely only so far. She can push him before it gets uh, too much for the boy. Ah, <sighs> shin <laughs> beam. Let me die. I would love to see that message in the game. We reliving part of his story here. Such a sweet boy. I'm pretty sure I've said that before, haven't I? 
and so self-deprecating. Oh, we're now getting uh, from Kaguya's ire and uh, jokes about him. She's now what, backing him in its entirety. I mean, out of all of them, out of all of them, it would probably be Ishigami to, like, make any sort of progress first. Mm. She has sensed his future. <laughs> And how long have you been planning it? If there was a, such a surefire way, yes, please let it let it be known. It depends on ultra romantic. It de uh, that would get kind of annoying. Strawberries, okay. Okay. She's getting a lot of flowers dying on her. <laughs> I guess it's the same form as like a one of those anonymous letters just with a lot more steps. And they're kind of out of the box thinking that, despite being creepy, is exactly the way of Ishigami. Uh, here, here's a present. It's a photo album of myself. That's a bit narcissistic, is it not? To be fair, the note itself was fine, but combined with everything else. I don't even think I've got enough photos to put in an album. Has there been someone sitting there all along? really redefining words just so that he fits into that bracket. I see. Is she... Mm. It just happens to be that all of his his traits and qualities seem to line up with it. <laughs> well, we can see what uh, Kaguya really thinks of uh, is is important there. Improve your grades. Where is he ranked currently? This might be a bit, bit hard. I like the track. Inspirational montage time. <laughs> Maybe it will go slightly better than uh, Chica's uh, montages. Final. It's it's such a a, a good idea. 
he's really got to climb for number one, can't give up that spot. Not to anyone, especially the number two. He gets distracted. <laughs> Even the slightest movements. So exams mean so much to them. Oh no. She's she's one of those easily distracted by uh, everything and anything has a phone too close to her. Oh no. How about putting your phone further away from you, or on silent? Objection! <laughs> Finally! Yes! She has so many duties as well as just studying normally. How is she meant to be... What's that? The best reason to do better in your education. Corner one. Of course, doting grandfathers aside. <laughs> Is he putting a grand scheme in place, or is he actually trying his hardest? It seemed like he was actually at home. <laughs> Serious. Seriously, Shigami, when he pulls his hair back, let's hope he actually studied the right thing. If truly the... <laughs> his, uh... Oh! That's why he's fighting so hard! Not for romantic feelings! His safe data's a risk. <laughs> to be fair, yeah, I think motivations like that would actually force me to be a bit more studious. But also, now someone's actually somewhat uh, rooting for him to do better. Well, he did better. There was never going to be such a massive stride. People at the top are going to try and stay there, but... Oh, this is where his true feelings of the matter come out. Putting in effort. And this is where it gets him. But also the fact that he's embittened by it like this much just proves that he, he really does, uh, did care. Good, 
good thing that he is still reaching next time. We can't drop him in at the deep end straight away. He needs to ease him into the studying. It's just a drop in the ocean. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Damn you, Ishigami. Look what you did to, the, to her. <laughs> that is one way to celebrate. <laughs> Oh, okay. Inviting them all over. <sighs> but inviting them all over... Oh no, she's going to really make strides at this. Uh... Ah, perfect time then. Look at her face. Of course she's got to try and put something together. Yeah, of course, it's short, short, such short notice. Thank you. Designation F. Ah, I see. There was no way of hiding it. I see. Is this going to cause any any major issues? Got to pretend to be someone else. Got to. It's it's the uh, stories you come up with the for the character. As long as you just. I more often you say. If you just use big words, Chica will buy it. <laughs> it. I see. Some sort of illicit relationship between uh, between butler, uh, well, servant and master. Coming up with ideas in her own head. I see. That's one way of getting around. Getting around it. Although that does mean that uh, the, the character might be easier to play then. Uh, excuse me. To be fair, that does look quite comfortable. Is this how actually how the night went? <laughs> Ash, is she a bit tired? <laughs> Just a little drowsy. But it unfortunately, yeah, her tricks to find out. But it was, uh, she's so long sleeper, <laughs> completely opposite of me with, uh, three, four in the morning, but she's, she's stayed up too late. This is going to go well. It's, did she, didn't they just say it was after midnight? I'm just going to do a, a video call. <laughs> I 
Of course, she'd jump into the straight. Oh. It's not like they're in the room. No, oh, I've done that trick. Just come straight out with it. There's, uh, what kind of smell is lovesickness? Do I even want to know? Of course, with the likes of his sister and uh, Fisher Pyro, of course he's not going to get away from this one. Good thing. Kaguya is uh, so out of it, she's not going to realise. That was a close call. <laughs> Oh no, so he's been messaging back and forth. Oh my. <laughs> uh, illicit relationships. I don't know if she was actually on top of things. Should be. I'm so upset right now. This. That would definitely make it easier for him to say, but also she's gonna fall asleep before she says anything, isn't she? We've been held in suspense for too long. It's, it's, it's just... <laughs> you can hear the pain in his voice. <laughs> Way out of your league for someone like you. Massive misunderstandings. Someone's going to need to clean up all that blood. Does she win, though? I mean, she got less sleep than usual. Some other, you know, with that misunderstanding being brought up, and Kai and uh, Fujiwara, they both know half a girl. seen them, seen them. One thinks it's short haired boy, the other thinks it's a, a blonde girl. They also talk to each other. Isn't this going to be found out? I, I, I just why did they choose Starship Troopers? Just why? <laughs> I want to know who came up with that idea of putting this in. But this episode was fun. At least we got someone admitting to their uh, uh, potential wants. Ishigami actually being somewhat straightforward with it. And with the boy trying so hard, to be fair, I think that would be exactly what would happen if I if I actually went and tried and studied. I'd only go up a little bit, not really worth or like the immediate payback from the studying wouldn't seem too obvious. But was it the lack of payoff with how much effort he, effort he put in? Was it the fact that Kaguya was putting a bit of trust and belief in him? Was it that he had a goal as to why he was doing it that really affected him so much? It was a little bit of everything. And in her 
a late night delirium. Is Kaguya going to remember even being on a call with him? What we saw with Ishigami and the, the, the Subame, we saw his backstory, his absence from school, what led up to it, and the growth, him trying hard again in the sports day. Not winning, you know, coming in second, but it's the valiant effort that he put in that we saw once again. When he puts his mind to it, he can really try. It doesn't pay off like all the movies, but he can certainly try. And it seems as though they're not on horrible terms, at least. But I'm sure there's a little bit of Ishigami in all of us. Really not liking other people's open um, displays of emotion. Also, thinking of that, this one aspect of Kaguya which I like but I think in other shows I wouldn't. And that's sort of the change of animation. You know, like when he was doing his Shinish and Habib and poking, him, poking himself in the face and his head doing the, the wobble because it was disconnected and just, it's like it was just turning that layer and it looked really cheap, really crappy but obviously because it was an effect it was intended. Other shows, I don't think they do it intentionally. They do it just like cut corners. It's so the bits where it makes like like a, a pop-up book or a bobblehead and stuff like that. It's actually somewhat endearing for some reason. But I do like... One part of this episode that I really did like was I think we should all close up and study at home for the exam period. Oh no, how... Oh no. That's a lie. <laughs> Yes! Finally! <laughs> All of them, there for their own specific reasons as to why they would want to get out, or or not, in one case. For, you know, you know, listening to her self-motivational pick-me-up tapes would be a lot easier if she was at home as well. <laughs> Don't worry. You can do this. I believe in you. And to think that we... Well, Kaguya almost had... A success story on her hands. Getting together a bunch of people to have time around someone's house. But because how pushy she was, getting it, right, we need it now, while the idea is fresh, before anything goes wrong, it went wrong. Could only get one person at such short notice. And since we've seen school, servant, casual, and now male servant... How many more outfit changes are we going to get? How many more personalities are going to be need are going to need to be made up? Yes, Saka is uh, such a versatile character. But once again, another episode of Kaguya out of the way. I say it like that's like like it's. I'm glad it's over. N no. I'm glad I watched it, definitely. Entertaining all the way down. I hope you liked it as well. If you did, please let me know. If you leave a like on the video and a comment down below, it helps out the channel. If you want to share it with friends and family, really annoy the hell out of them. It helps me out. But we're all really here because you keep coming back. So, as long as you're enjoying yourself, I think I'm doing alright. Make sure to get yourselves a bit of rest. Don't know when you intend to sleep, though. But I'll see you in the next one. If you would like to join the impromptu sleepover that is my channel, consider joining onto my Patreon. And hopefully there, there won't be any servants or nosebleeds, but only time will tell. So, I need to thank Electric Ant, Noku, Raywin, Kite, Sao, Arfia, Shiwan, Mats, Gurley, Cardboard, Croyville, Gintaman, William Welch, Dark Shadow, 7899, Mega42, Jeremiah, Tima, Finesse Kid, and everyone else. Because all of you actually make me strive to do better, even if I don't actually amount to much.